Good morning, Patriots. Welcome back to Rex Pants TV. I'm Captain Collins. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Tuesday, April 9th, 2024. Now let's take some time to relax with our new LSW short. Come on, I was so close. Hey, Hadassah. Not now, I'm busy. Hadassah. 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 Oh my gosh, what do you want? I'm very worried about your screen time. You've been on your phone so much. We barely have time to hang out anymore. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 whatever. I'm serious. Okay, whatever, bye. Hadassah! Hadassah! Oh my gosh, what do you want, Ramai? You keep messing me up! This is just some silly game that you're obsessed with. We're gonna hang out whether you like it or not. Uh-uh, nope, I don't want to. Too bad we're gonna touch grass whether you like it or not. No! Hadassah! What do you want? Just look into my two eyes. Fine. Just put the phone down for more than a minute. Why? You'll feel better without your phone. Please. No, I won't. Yes, you will. You'll get to see nature. I don't want to go outside. Doesn't it feel refreshing to take a break from your phone? Okay, whatever. Maybe touching grass is not that bad. I told you. Okay, whatever. Maybe we should hang out more. Finally, a change of mind. Do you think we should go get something to eat? Sure. I promise I won't have a phone obsession ever again. Okay. Wow, that was calming. Now let's go to your life for today's Autism Awareness segment. Thank you, Catherine. What's up, Patriots? In honor of Autism Awareness Month, we will be talking about Tim Burton. Tim was not diagnosed with autism, but showed the signs of having Asperger's syndrome, which may have contributed to his creative style, tendency to work repeatedly with the actors we, he connects with, and stories that center around misunderstood outsiders. Some believe that Tim's autism helped him develop his dark and quirky sensibility in films. Some of his films that you may know are The Nightmare Before Christmas, Edward Scissorhands, Dumbo, and so much more. Those are awesome movies. Now let's go to Harasa for today's lunch. Thank you, Elia. Today's lunch is beef and cheese nachos, salsa, Italian sandwich, pintos with pizzazz, garden side salad, ranch dressing, sliced pears, and Yorkshire milk. And tomorrow's breakfast is blueberry muffin, lucky charms, string cheese, fresh banana, and 100% grape juice. Students, please keep in mind the lunch menu can change at any time and to let your teachers know if you'll be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit, now let's go back to Catherine. Thank you, Hadassa. That sounds grim delicious. Tomorrow, 5th and 6th graders will have the chance to go to the Patriot store. The store is open from 7 15 to 5 a.m. Make sure you come on time. Patriots, please remember to keep your phone shut down and your backpacks at all times. If there is no chewing gum at school, please speed up for entering the building. And don't forget that you can only wear a school jacket or a sweater. Friday's Autism Awareness Month activity will be a good sport, so let's team up by wearing our favorite team's jersey. What jersey will you choose? Let's not forget what the book fair has to offer with all their magical books. Shall we scan through the options? I am fly, from my crown down to the kicks on my feet. I am my ancestors' wildest dreams. I love to pretend that I am a king, like T'Challa, a black panther. Like Chadwick Boseman, my enemies are no match. I am not an invisible man. People everywhere will see me like Ralph Ellison. I'm the people's champ. Like Muhammad Ali, gentle like a butterfly. My impact is strong like a bee. I am my ancestors' wildest dreams. 
Whoa, I still can't figure out what book I want. Make sure to have your money. The fair is only open from now till Friday. Teachers, please check the schedule to see when your class is going. Thursday, May 2nd is our third annual lip sync battle. It will be from 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. So if you would like to take part in this battle of the teachers and students, then go to room 200 or Miss Stone's room 189. I can't wait to see you there. Our yearbooks are available. It will be $45. It's always nice to have a memory of you and your classmates. Today, there are currently no grades testing. The next testing grade will be a kindergarten taking their NWA math on Thursday. So until then, keep studying to keep that knowledge going. Are you a funny person? Well, I most certainly have an offer for you. All you have to do is come to Route 200 and make jokes for all to laugh at on these announcements. The best jokes will be featured. Have you got what it takes? Here are our top unified kickboard leaders. Amazing job teachers, keep up the great work. I hope you remember our rewards for the challenge. K through second will have a pancake and PJ party, but you must complete 25 units on Lexia and 25 on Already. Third through fifth get a beach type day if they complete 25 units on Core 5 and 25 Imagine Math lessons. And finally, sixth through eighth will also be having a beach type day if they complete 25 Already and 25 Imagine Math. I know you all will make it. Tomorrow is no school day. So let's take the time to study for your next test or relax and play games. I'll take my time to play as much games as possible and also be responsible for my work. Today our girls flag football team will have a game against BMA. The game will start at 4.15pm. Let's reach out to support them now. Now let's go to Camilo for today's weather. Thank you, Catherine. Good morning, Patriots. Today's weather is 80 degrees Fahrenheit with cloudy skies. The solar eclipse was beautiful yesterday. In other weather news, a giant volcano has been discovered on Mars. The volcano is almost the height of Mount Everest. It is flattened due to erosion. You may be wondering why we didn't notice it sooner. Well, due to it being flattened, it made it hard to notice. This massive structure has erupted before, but it is still unclear if it is still active or may erupt again. Would you rather climb this or Mount Everest? I would choose Mount Everest. Now let's wish our patients happy birthday with Giselle. Thank you, Camila. Today's birthday boys and girls are Liliana Berra, Jace Bros, Chloe Joseph, and Josiah Versailles. Happy birthday. Now let's go back to Catherine. Thank you, Giselle. Patriots, who your packs expectations and present, praising yourself positively, act kind towards others, treat the schools of fire respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss Merkel, Miss Manon, Miss Dinkwall, Miss Arnold, Miss Shara, Miss M. Williams, and Miss Nelson for getting the correct answer to yesterday's J challenge. What's the national flower of Japan? The correct answer was Sakura or Cherry Blossom. Now for today's J challenge. Daily challenge. The more you take, the more you leave behind. What am I? Teachers, please see your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answer to be reviewed. More is being announced on the next morning announcement. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a terrific Tuesday. Have a great day!